hi everyone how are you so today i'll talk about the approach to pharma like my approach and also guys i think seeing the trend of my videos you all would have realized how lazy i am and how much i love procrastinating things yeah i do that all the time uh, i'm trying to improve on that for sure and also there's one more thing i keep forgetting to say at the in the end of my videos that is uh, guys i'm really sorry if i've not been able to reply to all the telegram messages that are there on my telegram i might have skipped a few so i i made a telegram group for the same and i think we can post our queries there and you know we can discuss things there and other people will also get benefited at the same time the link is there uh, in the description of this channel to that telegram group yeah so we can do that so now coming back to pharma so guys when i started doing pharma i thought i'll do it from the notes right and i did i did that too and i did it i did it cover to cover right and i think all i gained by the end of doing that was mental peace ki okay ha pharma khatam ho gaya so it was that was all i got i feel like there was no advancement in my pharma knowledge and i was not able to do previous year questions right so that means that was not the right way of doing that for me for me yeah so that is also that's also i want to clear that it's not that the notes are bad it's just that it doesn't work the same way for everyone right there are people who have secured great ranks just by reading notes but i wasn't one of them i need my things to be more colorful i need mnemonics and i have those adhd kind of personalities so i just need important topics to focus on right otherwise my mind keeps on wandering so i was one of those people right so uh, so by the end of uh, my preparation i got these 10 topics from zainab ma'am it is men it's mentioned in the uh, 15 day strategy video of hers so i got it from there and these are the 10 topics i focused on and i did these topics from nikita ma'am's videos she has amazingly covered pharma like with so many mnemonics and you know so many wonderful ways she has uh, you know taught us so i guess you should definitely watch nikita ma'am's videos for pharma right so i have uh, mentioned the links which i watched for these topics uh, right i might have missed a few so i guess you can search it yourself on you on youtube or on an academy and if you're unable to find any of the topics just let me know on telegram group i'll find and you know send it to you right we can do that and uh, there's one more thing which zaina ma'am only suggested for uh, pharma was that do pharma every day and from first aid that was the first time i picked first aid for pharma for the first time right so uh, what was the stra- what the strategy was to do pharma every day like two pages every day so for example if cns has four pages i did two every day so by by the end of two days my cns was finished so this is how i did uh, you know system wise pharma from first aid so that that's all i did for pharma in a nutshell so i guess that that made me very confident about pharma i was able to solve 70 to 80% of the questions which is huge i feel to get a good uh, decent seat right and uh, i guess people who really find difficult to do things and you know don't know what to do from where to do and want things to be concise so they can do this in this way for sure and this will definitely work out it it's a very tried and tested thing right so that's all guys for pharma and uh, yeah that's all bye bye good night